Hello, everybody. Happy Wednesday. Okay, hang on. Let's get this out of the way. Sound check. Let's get this out of the way. Sound check. Okay. Well, we're good to go. I don't really have any news this day. Whoops. Hang on. Okay. Uh, there's nothing I can think of channel wise, I guess. So, hey, man, what's up? I'm back. <laughs> Uh, we're going to play uh, Wolf Among Us for the first time today. So I'm pretty excited to start this. I know it's it's been out for a long time. Um, and it has been suggested to me, like, since I worked at GameStop. And I just never, like... I think it's it's a comic book series, and I wanted to get into that first. But I never really gave it a shot, so... But here we are. I'm going to try it anyway. It actually took me until today to realize it was a werewolf. There's a werewolf guy on the front. <laughs> you know, sometimes things just go over my head for a little while. But I get it eventually. I'll get there. Okay. It, it made everything go away. Twitch is gone now. Okay. There we go. Is there anybody out there? How's the sound? Is there anybody out there? How's the sound? I'm awfully loud. Hold on. I love the color scheme already. Sound is good. Okay. I love the graphic novels that are tied to the game. So the, the graphic novels are good. Do you know off the top of your head who does it? Is it Marvel or... It's not Marvel. Uh, Dark Horse or Image. Oh, shit. Stop doing that. Okay. What are we set up? Everything's set up. No, it's not. I need Twitch to be here and not OBS. And it's not working for some reason. Because Twitch has the ad time counter, so I don't leave during an ad. Or so I do leave during the ad. Anyway, anyway, anyway. Alright, we're ready. <laughs> Maybe Dark Horse, okay. Oh, they're in episodes. Episode 1, Faith. Start episode 1. Start. Oh, okay. The start didn't light up, so I didn't think it was clickable. The story is tailored to how you play. Uh-oh. I'm gonna accidentally bad ending again, like Harry Potter. <laughs> Once upon a time in New York City, there lived a community of fairy tale characters known as Fable Town. The fables who lived there arrived hundreds of years ago after they were exiled from their homelands. Through the use of magic spell called Glamour, they have protected their secret community from the mundane world. Sheriff Big B Wolf protects them from each other. Oh. Man, it's missed opportunity to have an E at the end of that wolf. And then we could be related. First time chat, Robin. Welcome. The air is the more moisture it can hold. So 103 with 31% humidity is a lot more humid than, say, 73 with 31% humidity. And it is muggy out there. I love I love the art style so far. I look around now, okay. <laughs> so it's not it's not a two D game. It's a they're three D models with this filter over it. 2D mesh or whatever. Cute little air conditioner. Tenant building south sometime after midnight. Toads. Oh, nope, I didn't read all that. Okay, never mind, they're gonna be there. 
Mr. Toad. Oh, shit. Big B! Listen, mate, She's I, I so know cute. I don't look human. It's a problem, I get it. I just stepped out the apartment for just a second to see what kind of damage this drunk shit is doing. Just cut me a break, yeah? I'll get me glamour first thing in the morning. Cross my arm. No need to kick up a fuss. <laughs> I'm looking at a three-foot toad <laughs> in a sweater. That's a problem. If you can't afford to look human, you're going to the farm. It's as simple as that. You can't send me up to live with those animals. You know what I mean. Go see a witch. Get a glamour. Big B, they're bleeding me dry, mate. The quality of the spout goes down, but the rates keep climbing up. Do you have any idea how much it costs to have an entire family in glamour? Oh no, oh no. Uh, uh. Oh, this is gonna be so bad for me. It's not even really worth dwelling on at this point. You're telling me to get it together. Oh, Whatever okay. It costs, it's worth it. You don't want me catching you out of glamour again. Fuck you now. See, this is what I told you about, Sheriff. You're just gonna stand there, do something, Big B, before he completely tears up the place. So, what am I walking into exactly? A woodsman's on another bender. He's been going on like that for hours. Turn this place to dust if you let him. He's in a fucking rage. Oh! This is the last straw, Big B. He has to go. So what set him off? Who knows why it was this time? Man's got a hair trigger. I avoid him as much Sorry, as possible. Sorry, I don't know if I have time when to read the things drinking? before I oh, have sure to click them. Stopped. <laughs> My... <laughs> uh, I didn't know anyone choice else paralysis was is hard here. Whew. Fables, at least the Mundies find them. Are Mundies regular people? Tell me, Tell me how to spend my money. Dad, the lights are shaking again. What did I say? You want a big bad wolf to take you away? No. Oh. Then get that fuck it's back so inside. It's so cute, though. <laughs> Use WASD to move. Hey, the mouse look around. Look me. Oh, okay. Phone. Okay? Get to. Let's I have to go. walk to it. Yeah, grab it. Look at the matchbook on the floor. Use the hand icon to pick it up. I was trying to. Oh, look at it. Look. I have to Take hold it. My bad. Know who I am now? Hey, look at me. Look at me. Get off of me. Oh, timing is crucial, I guess. If I let things happen, that he's probably just gonna murder whoever that is, so... No, I... Ugh, oh, I should've just kicked in the door. Don't knock! Kick that shit in! I already messed up. God damn you! <gasps> no way! Whoa, 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 hey, hey! You've got something on your face. Fuck are you talking about, you stupid... <laughs> <laughs> I'll fucking kill you! All right, everyone... I didn't even get to read the other two that were over here. <laughs> what are you gonna fucking do, huh? I'm worried about the timer. Get the fuck out of the way before you get the axe again. Woody, I'm gonna break your fucking face. Is that a fact? He's gonna remember yeah, that, yo. That's a fact. You got a shit fucking memory, Wolf. That's not how it went last time. This isn't last time. Oh no. It's one of these type of games. You gotta calm down. Uh uh the sink! <laughs> Challenge. 
Oh. Oh, I guess the bed now. Oh, this is so cool. It's very fast paced. Oh no, now he's Kratos. I don't think so. Oh, Q, what? Ooh. You're just gonna toss in something new? Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Toad likes his car, by the way. I don't know what that means. Is Toad in the game? No spoilers. Backseating is okay, but no spoilies. Hold up. A. Q. Last time I just touched the Q. I noticed it was all wiggly. I guess I have to keep pressing on it. You should probably get out of here. Look, I'm not leaving until I get what's mine. You're not getting sick, bitch. Oh, fucking put you on the ground. You hear me? Shut up. Oh, fucking shit. You bugged my jaw, you bastard. <laughs> and still you talk. Fuck you. Thanks. Shit. What are you doing here? What does he know His her? lips are sealed. She looks like the lady from um, Bioshock. Look, this is just the start of a shitty night for me. I just need the money he owes me, then I can go. Are you all right? I'm hunky-dory. Thanks for asking. Why was he hitting you? I mean, obviously he didn't want to Maybe pay Maybe you it. should ask him that. I will, but I asked you first. He asked me if I recognized him, knew who he was. I said I didn't. He started beating on me. Then you showed up, started beating on him. About Weird huh? turn of events. I'm the woodsman, you whore. I saved the little red riding hood from this monster. I cut this fucker open and filled his belly full of <laughs> stones and threw him in the fucking river. Up, That's who the fuck I DJ am, you Andre. stupid bitch. Hey, what did I say? I said be nice or you wait out. Come on. Yeah! Oh, maybe not so. Oh, look, he's okay. Oh, we messed up the bro's car. Whoops. <laughs> oh, that's Toad. Hey, Toad. My car. Yeah. <clears throat> Give me a second. Oh no, by all means. Take your time. Make yourself comfortable. <laughs> so, uh, how good is your insurance? I can't be mad at you. I called you, and you come to help. I can't be mad. But even when you help, things end up more fucked than they start. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna like this, I think. Well, at least you're not fucking dead. Oh, but did he not just see the toad guy? Oh, okay, a bunch. He bit me. Guy went. Oh no, I gotta keep it up. <laughs> oh no. Uh oh. Oh, I think he might not. He's not gonna make that. Thanks, lady. <laughs> New book of fables entry unlocked. My heart is racing. This is so fast paced. I love it. Pixel. Aw. Oh. <clears throat> 
Thanks. Don't mention it. We should probably go easy or not. <laughs> you all right back there? I it's mean, chaos, eyes, so... <laughs> who knows? You're not really supposed to do that, are Dragon you? Dragon wing. Not if I can avoid it. Great. Doesn't even the guy's got me. an axe in his brain. He's not feeling that. It's more from me. He'll be fine. I'll kill you, you fucking bitch. Let me help you. <laughs> oh, no? I no? Having a bad day. That makes two of us. It's gonna show it? I guess okay. it's a good thing fables are hard to kill. Suppose it is. Oh, are they like semi-immortal? Like demigods or whatever? That means that she's not one, right? Mongoose. I love all the back details. It's so it's this is nice. What well, uh yep. Here. Thanks. So it's the renegade playthrough, pretty much, yeah. <laughs> I'm a specter fool, a doodle boy. <laughs> Who do you work for, really? Hold on, I need to try something. Did that pause it? Okay, good. These lips are sealed. Sorry. Hey, you like my ribbon? Beautiful. Thank you. She'll remember that. <laughs> That's gonna I feel be a like thing. We've met before. We probably have. We all sort of knew each other at one point or another. But things change, I guess. Oh, maybe I she's guess. a fable. Alley. <laughs> Stop. We don't have to make any more of a thing out of it than it already is. It's not just about you. I can't have him running around the city in the state he's in. Good, oh, the dude's just the axe is gone. About me. That's not what I mean. How much was the OJ? Look, you upset her. A hundred. I'm guessing it'd be bad for you to show up empty-handed. I'll be fine. Give her that Let's money. Let's see, I've got, uh... It's twenty. Forty. Seven. Eight. Fifty-eight. It's all I got. Uh, it'll help, I'm, right? I'm Take sure it. I'm gonna regret that. It's okay. Look, I'm I'll gonna need fine. it later or something. You've done enough, really. Just take the money, okay? You got me out of a bad situation back there. Thanks. I'm still gonna Her need bruises to make me sad. I have to go drop off what I have. Meet me back at my office then. It's a little late for an office visit, Sheriff. I'll swing by your apartment. How do you know where you I am? You live in the smallest apartment in the woodlands. Everyone knows that. Good to know. You should get cleaned up. Wow. You look like shit. And I don't use that term lightly. Some of these look pretty bad. Oh, I didn't have enough time to read it. Work. Okay. Or maybe not. Hey. I need to tell you something. What is it? You're not as bad as everyone says you are. Aw. She's sweet. I'll see you around. She's gonna turn into a demon. Wolf. Rip my heart out. 
I'm just gonna go on a limb. She's the whole her being framed by the King Street. That has to be some kind of like thing. <laughs> it's gotta be tied some something. Especially now that I know that this is a comic series, there's going to be a lot of like visual. Oh, what's the term I'm looking for? There's gonna be a lot of visual direction. Uh, there's probably gonna be a lot of color direction. Yeah, look, right here, color direction. I've got color theory all over it. It's really pretty though. There's gonna be framing, there's gonna be symbols everywhere. The dude with the axe in his head reminds me of Michael Myers. Turn around, so he's gone. <laughs> Big B is like that, but are you? I don't know what you're asking. <laughs> DJ said crazy frog. Not crazy frog has money. He got money from his DJ gig. <laughs> Poor toad. With a luxury apartment, it's Fable Town late. Can I walk on the road? No. Weird camera turn when I go sideways? It's fine. Luxury apartments. Wish they wouldn't advertise that. Why would they not advertise that they're luxury? Bill Willingham. That must be the... Oh, I love this parallax over here. Do you guys see the bushes? I'm sorry. This looks nice. Especially coming from, like, Cult of the Lamb, where the parallax is just the same, but it's very basic. This looks really good. Stay off the grass. Sometimes be a discipline. He's a wolf, right? He can go pee on the grass and just make them mad. There's a lady. <laughs> Don't make me come over there. Look, I've got an hour of paperwork ahead of me, and I've already had to deal with one asshole tonight, so just... <sighs> Sorry, Bigby. Didn't mean to be an asshole. Beauty. This is Big B. That Hello, makes sense, I wasn't expecting anyone. I know this looks a little odd. Why'd you hide when I walked up? Well, I didn't know who it was. You can't be too careful these days. Uh... No. Can't. Doubt. Damn it, I'm late. So why was she here? She's leaving? Does she live here? Please, Bigby. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. He worries too much as it is, and it would just make my life a lot easier. Just please. Sure. You promise? I promise. Thank you. You're showing Bigby. this 14 off. I'll explain it all to you later. I will, but I have to go. Okay. Thank you for trusting me. Beauty? Really, I I appreciate it. Oh, like Maybe. Beauty and the Beast? Her shoes are cute. Add time. That's why I paused it earlier, by the way, just to make sure I didn't accidentally skip stuff. Like, if it's gonna throw me into situations where I'm gonna have to, like, quick time events, that's the term for it. <laughs> I don't want that to happen, and it's like, we're gonna play an ad, and there's nothing I'm gonna be able to do about it. Uh, talk to the dude. No, look at this first. Look at this, look at it!
been a while since I got any mail. Okay, well, at least it tells me it's ad, ad starts in a minute. Seventh day in a row. No mail. I don't ever get any mail unless it's ads. What do you want, ads? He wants his coupons. He's asleep. Okay, I'm actually gonna pause it here and then I'm gonna let Ad roll. I'm gonna run to the bathroom and I'll be right back. So I'll see you guys in a minute. Two. All right. Did I fix it? I fixed it. Okay. You guys, I noticed. Uh, you'll notice I changed the background graphic. It's still something I did though, so it's still like my landscapes. But as I start adding more stuff to my pro uh, portfolio, I'll change that every once in a while, just so that it's new stuff. Uh, while we're here, let's check this out. Oh, it's like history stuff? Not history stuff, like lore. Duh. The big bad wolf. Oh, I love this. I love this. This is so great. <laughs> this, oh, it's a, the spell that they use. Okay. I love the menu. This is neato. I don't want to look at the achievements because I feel like they'll give spoilers. Can I not talk to him? Is he asleep? Hey, you wink. Grimble. Uh, probably for the best. He looks a little bit like the guy from um, 
that really old show, Andy Griffith. He's like the dude from Andy Griffith. My catcher needs to dust this guy. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm hold on. <laughs> I'm having issues. Subtitles, please. I can't hear without my subtitles. <laughs> okay, resume. Did you, did you guys know that they're starting to do movies like in the theater with subtitles? Or maybe they've always done that. But I, I just noticed it the other day when I went to... I'm looking at a movie. And there was like closed captioning. Had its own little time. It would be a tiny theater. That was pretty neat. Hey, there's a thing on the ground. I almost missed that. Damn thing fell off again. Did it? Or is someone pulling it off? How much longer is this gonna go on? Oh, it does look like it's just tape. 204. I think the sheriff would get a permanent listing. They don't want you here, is what it sounds like. What's this? What's this? Oh, knowing that this is the developer that did, like, Puzzle Agent, this is super awesome. Because Puzzle Agent was all flat. Which is what I was expecting this to be. It's very obviously 3D models. 204. 204. 204. His knuckles are all f messed up. Bigby. Hey, wait up. Mm -mm. Oh. Have you seen my wife? Have you seen Beauty? Nope. Haven't seen her. Oh. Okay. Sorry to bother you. Oh no, I lied to Beast. Something's going on. I should have just stayed out of it. Oh, no Mass Effect Codex voice acting, I'm afraid. Oh, okay, I see what you're saying. That's fine. I don't mind reading and talking out loud. That's generally something I say for, like, after I've gotten a bunch of them. That's not something you can do anymore. The take the phone off the hook. I'm not available. I have anxiety about getting my coffee because I'm afraid it's gonna throw a quick time a <laughs> pin at me. Shouldn't we be looking for this fable that's running around with an axe in the back of his head? Damn it. Don't, don't put it back in the frit. Oh my god, just like a just, mm. Why do you have a fridge and a freezer if you're not gonna if you utilize your freezer the way you're supposed to? Oh, no, he gets pissed off because there's no ice in the tray. I just fill up the ice. Okay. <laughs> Blue, Blue beard. beard. What was the other one? Something penny. I'm so glad I turned the subtitles. He's mumbling now to me. <gasps> Am I getting old? Am I going deaf? <laughs> Chad, I'm scared. <laughs> Don't even remember ordering that. Probably a bad sign. That's gross. How long has it been here then? Your ashtray is gross. Huff and Puff are cigarettes. The only thing in this man's fridge 
was a carton of cigarettes. Is that what you're telling me? Will you open this again? He won't open it again. Let's take out. Oh my god, what? What, did your dinner fall asleep on you? Hey, Colin, get up. Is your roommate, bro? <laughs> uh, oh, hey, Big B. I'm in your chair, huh? Yeah, get out. <laughs> Supposed to lay on the floor. Got a smoke? Thanks. A couple thousand more of these will be even on that house you owe me. This has got to stop. You can't keep sneaking off the farm like this. Is that a, is that a ball? The fresh air and sunshine pitch they sell you No, it's a beer bottle, okay. I didn't escape out of the homelands to end up in some prison, okay? Don't send me back there, Bigby. You don't know what it's like, okay? You haven't been there. Calm down. I'm not sending you back. Aw, the pig smiled at me. That for me? Nope. <laughs> the house didn't blow itself down, Bigby. That's all I'm saying. Do with that what you will. Now, I'm not saying it's reason enough for me to have definitely been offered a drink, but, uh, it would have helped ease some of the pain you once caused me, yes. It also would have shown everyone how different you are now. Nice. I take it all back. This is why everyone hates you. So, everyone hates me. Nah, I'm just giving you shit. Oh, okay, I thought that was gonna be I'm sarcastic. Doing my best here. Clearly, oh, he's that is actually not upset. True. What with the selfishness with the bourbon. But, Bro, uh, no, you can go get your own bourbon. Um, hates the wrong word. They fear you more than anything. You That's hate fine. a lot of people back in your day. I thought we were all supposed to have a fresh start here. I can't change the past. Well, you can't change people's memories either. Look, I'm not saying it's fair, but it's real. People are scared of you. I mean, That's okay. look at your hands. They should be. He's a police officer. Who'd you get in a fight with? A fable, right? I'm sure you're not going around punching Mondays. I was doing my job, believe it or not. Your job is to beat the shit out of fables? Sometimes I take them to the farm. Fuck you. <laughs> you think my job is easy? You try keeping a bunch of fables from killing each other. How do you think this all works? I don't know. Uh, How? By being big and being bad. By being big and being bad. Don't say that shit in front of people. It's embarrassing. That's the attitude that gets you in trouble. I'm sure you were shitty to everyone you came across tonight. No, I wasn't. Name there was a lady. One. I have a weakness. Uh, I don't actually know her name. Awesome. Great example. Actually, I was nice to all of those people that it gave me options for, to, to be fair. Life is easy. One of them was nice. Right? Be. And we live a long fucking time. I know you like this whole lone wolf thing you got going for yourself. But I've seen the way you look at snow, okay? You're not fooling me. Will you shut up? Well, maybe if my throat wasn't so parched, I wouldn't have to keep talking. Wait, that doesn't make sense. Just give sense. me a drink, please. Colin, enough already. I haven't slept look, in two days. Look, he asked days. nice. You can I go get out a second him story now. window. I was mad because he was expecting it. I want to get in it. two seconds of shut-eye before I... 
Look, if I give you this, will you let me sleep? Yeah, yeah, all right. Probably. I have two weaknesses. Thanks, Big B. <laughs> Girls and cute animals. <laughs> oh, jeez. I mean, I don't know what else I expected. It's not like he was gonna pick it up and drink it. <laughs> That's where you sleep, bro? That's not healthy for your back. <laughs> Do I have a run button? Saunter faster? Big B. Snow. Come with me. Snow. Yeah, she's pretty. Snow. What? <gasps> she's got snowflakes on her. Sorry, um, I'm. Like collar or whatever. What is it? What happened? I just can't get into it this second. We need to hurry to. Hi. Hello. Good morning or evening. Yeah. These walls are paper thin. We need to be careful. We'll talk outside. I got achievement. Completed chapter two. It's gonna be one of the girls from earlier. No. You knew this girl? Is she's not a Mundy, right? Who was she? Did I, I do that? Could I, I knew have saved her? In Faith Town. She looks familiar. A working girl? A working girl? I don't... I mean, I'm a working... Oh. The woodsman. He attacked her, I stepped in. And he threatened to kill us both. Yeah, no. see, I told you we should have been going after him! He... I don't think anything yet. Just... Give me a second. He has axe, it's and her just... head is... Terrible. So... Who found her? I did. She was just like this. I didn't touch her. I grabbed Grimble's jacket to cover her with. Then, I came to get you right away. No one else was with you? We were no. just here too, so it had to have, like, Big just P. happen. Did one of us do this? There hasn't been a murder in Fable Town in a long time. All the more reason we shouldn't start a panic before we know what's going on. I'm confused. Have a look around. We don't have much time before people will be coming through. Big dude was literally threatening to murder her with axe, and that's not like a even. She's got something in her mouth. Okay, I was about to say, they're gonna let me investigate, right? <laughs> what is. There's and a ring. some kind of symbol here. Huh. I, I don't recognize it. Neither do I. Strange cut. What did this to her? What could do something like that? Either something very sharp, 
or something with magic attached to it. I guess. Or you know, she was next. placed here with some care. What do you mean? You can see that someone didn't just toss her here. She was deliberately placed for us to find. What kind of monster would do this? Sorry, this is just so surreal. <sighs> um, what, what do you want to do next? We still have some time. I should keep investigating the area. Okay, good idea. Uh, uh. Oh, excuse me. Hey, it's not. You all right? Yes, thanks. But you should hurry. We don't have much time left. We should head back inside soon. Okay, well, I wanted to see if there, cause there was blood, obviously, here. Yeah, there we go. Blood. Drops of blood. I'd say it's been here an hour, maybe. How long have we been in our apartment? Talking with the pig. No signs that it's been here long. What is that? Fabric. Looks like jeans. Doesn't tell me much. Scrap of fabric. Hello. Hi, Data. Just some loose trash. Yep, more blood. Someone might have hopped the fence, got caught, then left the trail oh, I found that's earlier. My flesh. Thank you. Blood. Still wet. Sharp enough. So should I do the touch option first and then the look option? I'm surprised the garbage men can even find their way here. We move it. Hi, handsome. Oh, spacebar pauses it. I wonder if that works for cutscenes too. Oh, hey, wait, I can saunter faster. No, you can't. You can't lay here. I well, okay, maybe. You're so cute. Why are you so cute, stupid cat? <laughs> saunter faster. Can I not go in this alley? Alright, you are kind of in the way though. I need you to, to leave. You're so cute. Come here, honey. Why don't you sit with me? Ugh. Yeah, sit with me. Thank you. Sorry. He's stubborn. He's probably gonna get right back to the same spot. Yeah? You mad at me now? I'm gonna be mad if you bite me. You better not. <laughs> Thank you. What are you doing? Yeah, what are you better doing? Be thorough. Sure, just hurry up. We don't have much what time. What a weirdo.
We should move her before anyone shows up. We'll find out more at the business office. She'll be in the books. I'm sure of it. Bigby, do you have any idea what's going on? This is a message. A message? I don't know, Bigby. I get complaints at the office all the time, but... Just what no. about this makes you think that? Whoever did this isn't exactly hiding it. The placement of the head, it's exact, purposeful. She was placed here precisely for us to find. All of us. Well, yes. I guess you're right. The killer wanted us to know what they had done. Oh, I'm a good detective. <laughs> I'm gonna have to tell Crane about this. I mean, obviously. As long as King Cole is gone, he's acting mayor. He needs to know. And he's so going King to find again. it anyway, so we may as well get out in front of it. It'll just be worse if he finds that we held it from him. I guess it's useless to drag it out. That's how I feel too. I'm sure he won't be happy, but it's just part of the process. Hopefully he can be rational about it. I wouldn't hold my breath. <sighs> I'm not. I just don't want him interfering. Crane's not what's important right now. We need to figure out who this girl was so we can find whoever did this. Take this back to Dr. Swinehart. He can take a look at it. I'll meet you at the business office. That sucks. Sorry. I feel like I did that. Completed chapter three of episode one. Oh, right. Right. Only on episode one. What are you, blind? Why, you don't see there's a line? I've been standing here a half hour already. You get to just walk in? Must be nice being the sheriff. Do whatever the fuck you like. I work here. And what great work you do, sheriff. Hmm. That didn't feel very genuine. <laughs> Fucker. Nobody cares about you. Is this an office? Because you are the one bringing this to me, Miss Snow. The one who so simply stumbled upon this catastrophe on our very doorstep. The last thing I need with Mayor Cole away is a hysteria. Do you understand me? Yes, of course I Don't do. Don't interrupt me, Miss Snow. You asked me a question. Don't change the subject. You are to blame for this unpleasantness, Miss Snow. I brought you this news as soon as I could. You are trusted to keep things running smoothly around here. This is a you disaster. Yeah, Back off, God. Ichabod. It's not her fault. I don't need your help, Big B. Instead of trying to assign blame, maybe we should figure out how to catch the fucker who did this. Oh, says the man who is most to blame for this catastrophe. How convenient. Sheriff, you are the one charged with protecting the citizens of Fabletown. Your failure to do so cost someone their life and the safety of the entire community. Tell me you've been doing something. Are there any leads? Suspects? Anything. Anything at all. Any shred of evidence you two know what the hell you're doing. Because right now, I have half a mind to fire the both of you. The woodsman is a person of interest. From what we've been able to gather, he was last seen with the victim. The woodsman? That drunk wretch was the cause of this? It's a lead. Nothing certain. Is that yet. to say no? I'll find him. Get him in here if that's all you have to go on. I just wanted to get him you to show up. You two need to get a handle on this situation quickly and quietly. The last thing we need is all of Fable Town knowing there's a killer amongst us. Snow. Yes? Sir? Call Vivian right this minute and let her know I'm coming in early for my massage. I will. Massage. Where is the bottle of wine you were to purchase? Wine and massage. Okay. Don't bother. Forget it. You can't do anything right. I swear to God, dude. If anybody do your job, punch Sheriff. that guy. Well, we'll find someone who can. Yeah, don't say anything, I guess. You would have just pissed him off more. Yeah, I know. <sighs> well, that could have gone better. Well, maybe we should have dragged it out. For what it's worth, I still think it was better to tell him. Yeah, maybe. Oh, Crane doesn't like people smoking and... I was about to Never say, mind. don't stop. Just Smoke away. Wine to a massage? Probably a gift. 
The weird part of that is that he's actually being nice to someone. I know he's I bought though. that damn bottle. Is... is he gone? Hold on. Pause. Okay, good. Yes, guys. thankfully. So I have an ad starting in a second. Oh. Uh... Buffkin! Hello, Miss Snow. Okay, alright, we're gonna stop there for now and I'll let Ad play. I'll be right back, you guys, as soon as I get. I hate that it makes it go away, like, every single time. Drinking? This early? Where did you get that? It was by Mr. Rickabod's desk. Then don't you think it probably belongs to him? Maybe. <laughs> How are you today, Mr. Bigby? Fine, Aww. Buffkin. Thanks for asking. Buffkin. Buffkin, get the books. Which books? The ones with all the fables in it. Mm, not sure that was any more specific. Bring the first three. Be back in a few minutes. What's the deal with this tree? He knows the, the ones I'm talking about. There's bound to be information on her here. Somewhere. We'll Ship? at least be able to get her real name from the books whenever Buffkin finds them. In the meantime, poke around. Maybe the mirror can help. I really have to get this appointment squared away, but let me know if you need anything. Yay, I guess look around a magic library. Hi. 
magic lamps are pretty much just lamps after the genie's been freed. That's true. Yes, that's right. Touch it. <laughs> Try. Yes, I mean, I touched it. It's nice. It actually has like a mirror effect on it. Hey, Magic Mirror, I got a question. You know the rule. I don't have time for this shit. Your impatience is callow. You're needlessly cruel, but have some respect for our history and rules. Oh, he rhymes! <sighs> mirror, mirror. Uh, if you're able, tell me all about this fable. See? Was that so hard? Oh, he... Yeah, I'm about two seconds away from kicking a hole in you. <laughs> There's no need for that. Fine. Of which fable do you wish to know? I don't know her name. Not yet, anyway. Well, until you do, I can't help you. Show me the woodsman. Where is he? What you see is complete. The woodsman stumbles down the street. <laughs> no shit. Which street? I'm sorry, Bigby. I can only show you what can be seen. Show me Snow White. So say she's on the phone. It's right there. Not much of a request. She's in this very room. Show me Buffkin. Hey, put down the bottle and get to work. <laughs> Still looking. <laughs> Nobody right now. Cute. Very well. Please return should you wish to ask about someone else or someone new. Well, I'm sure we'll get it all cleared up. Okay. Thank you. So if there's a Snow White, is there a Seven Dwarves as well? Where's her bros at? Her seven husbands? Because that would be pretty funny. <laughs> oh right, I can saunter faster. Stuff though. I can't go in here either. What? I can't read any of this shit. I can help. Yeah. Did he just I... land on her book? We look out for each other. Like his no, butt no, is all like... in her deal. This is the one. Where is this symbol from? Which family or story? That's an odd one. Family name? Alelairo. I'll go look it up. Alelairo. That means every kind of fur in German. Donkey skin. Yes. What does it say? Donkey skin girl, also known as donkey skin, also known as <laughs> ass skin, <laughs> uh, prefers to go by the name Faith. Poetic? Buffkin, we don't need the commentary. The story of donkey skin. There was once a great king with a beautiful queen. The queen grew ill and had her husband promise to only marry the most beautiful girl in the kingdom. After a long search, it became clear that the only woman in the land that could match her beauty was... Uh, his daughter, Faith. 
She had a magic cloak made from the skin of her father's prized donkey that would hide her beauty so she could escape his kingdom. Eventually, she married a prince who could see past the magic cloak and knew her true beauty. And they lived happily ever after. Should I mark it, Miss Snow? Yes. Please. And what's her husband's name? Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. We got what we came for. Yeah. Her name's Faith. She was married to Prince Lawrence. I mean, that's more than her we... Her name was Faith. Yeah. We should talk to the husband. You think he did it? Nothing would surprise me at this point. We can't rule him out. What a sad backstory. Any information on fables in our community will be somewhere in these books. We already know her name, but feel free to have a look if you like. There are dwarves! Confirmed, they're so cute. Yeah, dwarves. The less said about that, the better. Oh, uh oh. Yeah, that's me. Back when. Mm. Long time ago. <laughs> Haven't seen him in a while. Well, that's how you looked when we met, remember? Yeah, I remember. And him. The woodsman? Yep, and his axe. story was. Beauty in happier days. And her man, Beast. Funny. Weird. Colin and his brothers. <laughs> the three little pigs. Oh, it's... It's the... Uh... Not the Flying Dutchman, the... The Headless Horseman! <laughs> Is this... Yeah, that's her, all right. Long time ago. Just her mom and her dad? I haven't seen Badger around for a while. He likes his privacy, I think. I wish Toad would like his a bit more. Nice hat. Ichabod Crane. Scared shitless. What's that? Your boss. His finest moment. <laughs> Hard to understand how he ended up running this place. Well, maybe it's time that changed. Is there anything torn? I love this art style, by the way. This, the trees with the leaves like this, this is very old school Disney. Like the artist I've been studying, Ivan Earl, he does a lot of his stuff this way. This looks really cool. Can I look at that other book one more time? Can you not? Will you go over here? Bufkin, translate. Hmm, an exquisite design from the good china of Toad Hall. Mr. Toad? He probably wrote this in himself. What's up, Gertie? I am loving this game so far. It's great. It's really fast-paced. Like, the beginning, like, had my heart racing. But I love the, like, uh, I like... 
I like the, the dark humor, I like the style, I like the writing, and the fact that it was a comic, it's got a lot of like comic tropes in it as far as like stylization and color direction. It's really cool. I've been nerding out about the art style like this whole time. This looks familiar. Yes. Great game. From the Acts of the Woodsman, a druid blessing actually. Someone I can see why people thing. have suggested this to me over the years. What's it say about that? It says brickle bit in an older elvish hand. What's brickle bit? A magic word. What's it do? It makes animals shit gold. Uh, okay. See, it definitely has a strange humor. What's that? It reads. Mark of the House of the Frog Prince. Quite who I'm looking for. This is cool again, whatever this is. Probably the best tale game in my opinion. Oh, okay, good. I've really enjoyed them as a company so far. Like, I know they just did an Expanse game, and I haven't seen the Expanse. I don't know anything about it. But I'm, I'm happy to see them, like, putting out more, th like, newer things. Still being a, a company. Because last I heard, they weren't around anymore. Right, we did that. Oops, not escape. I mean, Toad was mentioned a couple times, and Lancelot's name was on that Toad page. I think we should see Toad. What's that? It's the ship. It's like Peter Pan's ship. Tarot cards. Jack brought them back from Apple. Who knows where they were before that? Or what he did to get them. Who? Strength. I guess it comes in all forms. Do it a second time? Tower? Doesn't that mean fire? Damn. And death. What the fuck is this supposed to mean? Oh, he kept that one. <laughs> okay. Confused look. Yeah, they went bust, but someone bought them out. Their formula got pretty stale after a while, but they definitely had some standouts. This and the takes from oh tales from the Borderlands. Okay, I do like Borderlands as a series. So I know I tried. They did one that was what was it's a book and it's it, it's a TV show and everybody liked it, but it had a bunch of nudity in it and I just didn't care. God, what is it called? I the, the guy that does it is R R Martin. Game of Thrones, there you go. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, they did a Game of Thrones one, and I tried to play it and couldn't get into it. But I don't like Game of Thrones, so I guess... Not that I dislike it, I just didn't get into it. It was a little weird. Can we leave? Do I have to talk to the lady? I tried to read that book. <laughs> um... I have a soft spot for kids, so when something bad happens to a kid, I kind of, <laughs> I can nope out, and it, like, right off the, off the bat, something bad happens to a kid. Oh, right, the, the, hold on. You know what this means? Tarot is a backwards art. I wouldn't put too much stock in its wisdom, Bigby. That wasn't Nothing a rhyme. You've been so helpful. Prevision's muddy. I'm as clear as a window. 
I love this type of lore, fairy tales, and stuff. Yeah, I really like their take on the fairy tale thing. This seems really cool. Talk to it. Mirror, mirror, blah, blah, Abel, blah, blah, blah about this fable. I of tried. which fable do you wish to know? <laughs> you gave him credit for trying. Show me... Show me faith. Through powerful magic, her whereabouts concealed. Unfortunately for you, these lips are sealed. What? These lips are sealed. It's not my choice of phrasing, Bigby. It's simply the way this has she to be. She said that earlier, too. Show me Faith's father, the old king. Check that out. Oh. Guess that crosses him off the suspect list. He's a prince, I think. Show me Prince Lawrence. What's he been doing? Where is this? Where's what? He did. Do you know where Prince Lawrence lives? If he's a prince, probably relocated in the South Bronx. Yellow building, red window shutters. Red frames. Yep, that's the one. I can take us there. Jeez, okay. Nobody right now. Anything we can use? Yeah, that'll have to do for now. Come on, we're going over there. What? I don't understand why they, he said they couldn't show Sorry. her face. Sorry, I have to get that. She's the one that died. Hello, Woodland's business office. Yes, I... He is. Hold on. Big B. It's for you. Oh. Big B, it's me, Hello. You there? What do you want? Big B, shit. Listen, right? There's a bloke upstairs going through all the woodsman things. Get over here, Big B, before he. Oh, wait, hang on. Boy, shit. Hey! What was that about? Hard to say. Something going on over at Toad's place. What about oh, no. Faith's husband? I don't know. I couldn't really tell. But he could be in trouble. And we should go there anyway to search her apartment. Toad might have to wait. Oh, she glitched out a little. Whenever you're ready. Let's go. Did Toad Excuse say who me? was there? Was it the woodsman? I don't know. It's possible. Whoever it was, it didn't seem like Toad was happy to see him. It's not the woodsman well, and he would have said maybe it. Maybe Prince Lawrence can wait. Yeah, he didn't see him. He could use some help, too. Well, where to first? Mm. Mm. Big, big shit. Listen, right? There's a bloke upstairs going through all the woodsman things. You think he did it? What's her husband's name? Lawrence. Oh, Prince no! This is a huge choice. What am I gonna do? Okay. Toad is alive right now and is in danger. His life is in danger, so I might be able to save him. That guy looked like he was already dead. I have a feeling the guy going through what's been stuffed. Toad sounds like he needs help right now. We can check in on Prince Lawrence. After. Okay. I'm not looking forward to breaking the news to him anyway. Glass and slipper shoes. That's cute! And we ended up going out the window and I landed on Toad's car. You guys made a real mess. Yeah. <laughs> Looks worse than the day. <laughs> oh no, there's a huge hole in the side of the building! Somebody up there? Hey! Wait here. Yeah, it definitely wasn't the woodsman. Oh, oh, we're gonna fight. It's gonna be a fight. No. You know what? I shouldn't have said anything. <laughs> I should have just come up here.
dumb. That was dumb. I'm sorry. That's enough, all right? Just shut it. I should go look at the thing though. Somebody's crying. <sighs> I probably should have looked at that thing. Is that his son? Toads, I think. Be nice in there, okay? Hey, Toad, you in there? <laughs> Big B and Miss White. Surely you didn't come all this way just for my bother. Sorry, Big B. It's embarrassing to have to admit, but uh, I thought it was someone else in Woody's place. There wasn't, though. Uh, not when I checked. <laughs> Nothing but a leaky drain pipe. Imagination must have got the best of me. So, you know, false alarm. Sorry for dragging Miss White into this. There was someone, but they took off when we got here. Is that right? I guess your dad's ears have a year or two left. Haven't gone totally to the dogs, eh? Are you all right? He's fine, Miss White. Just stung his little toe. Better swimmer than Walker, just like his dad. Wanna? So, I guess you'll be taking off now. No need to hang around here anymore. I mean, I'm sorry you came all the way here for nothing. But it was nothing, really. I'll leave when I'm ready, Toad. I just want to check things out first. The longer you talk, the longer this takes. So just stand over there and shut all up. All right, all right. I just don't want to waste your time, is all. Uh, have a seat. Have a cup of tea. Whatever you like. Whew. Grown-ups. Am I right? Uh... Hey, you know what? Flycatcher said you had a pretty awesome insect collection. I'd really love to see it. Is it in your room? It has a weevil. Cool. Just mind the upholstery while you're looking for nothing. Yeah, sure thing. How'd this happen? Fucking hell. Damn thing must have fell off a table. Uh-huh. The lamp just fell off the table. All the boy was faffing about, playing salts and swordfish. Who knows with the lad? Sods and swordfish. Why is he being weird? Your side's blood. Still fresh. Oh, well, I'll cut me end. <laughs> Ran around like a tit trying to pick out a wrap. Must have got some on the furnishments. Lamp in pieces, blood on the wall. It's awful, I know. Sounds yeah. painful. Oi, don't you go mother ending now. The wound didn't sit very long, you know. Perks of being a fable, I suppose. <laughs> and a frog. He likes racing. There's more blood over here. On the poker? Yeah. What happened? Oh, well, that's... That's how it happened, didn't it? Oh, I was... I was poking the coals and it slipped a bit. Sliced up in my foot like a seashell. Look like a shit ugly thing. Mm -hmm. like if you're gonna say something, it. out with it. Wait, you dropped it on your foot? 
You told me before that you cut your hand. Yeah, no, I, I did cut my hand. I cut my hand first, and that made me drop the damn thing on my foot. <laughs> Down. Uh, ruin this flip of events, really. And the kid was crying. Uh, Are you beating God, your kid? You don't make a big faff out of this. Because I'm about There's to get nothing upset. nothing to solve here, Sheriff. I'm telling you everything that happened. Why don't you believe me? I mean, things happen, you know. I think maybe you're hiding something. Hiding something? Maybe. But uh, to tell you the truth, I don't know yet. I know you're lying about yep. something. But I'm not... You're just gonna make it worse for yourself the longer you keep up the act. I'm not bullshitting you. Honest. We'll see. Alright, I have an ad starting and I have to run to the bathroom, so I'll be right back. Unpause. <sighs> Look at the window. Look at the window. Is it now? If it's blood, you know what happened. I no, there's marks here on the window sill. And what's that about? No real reason. Just last night when I'd come out, I was in a, a downright dizzy, mate, as you would be. And <laughs> I plum forgot the keys to this place. And I had to climb in through the bloody window. Really? 
Scared Junior off to death. Oh, okay. So somebody came in through the window. And he attacked him with the poker. There's a mark over here, too. What you mean? There's a clean space in the dust over here. Oh, maybe one of Junior's toys or something? I mean, who knows? Bloody hell, Bigby. What sinister bit have you uncovered this time? I left the tap water running. Didn't stop the recycling. What's the point of all this, mate? Really? That broken lamp used to be here, right? Just tell me what happened. Nothing happened, mate. Nothing! And why did the lamp have to be there? Of all the blooming pointless inquiries. It's my own place. Don't you think I'll know what happens in it? Because the lamp was always over here, Toad. It was over here. Now it's there. The space in the dust is from where you oh, moved I it. I did some refiguring. Who fucking cares? Bloody hell, mate. Come on. Get off with this. Oh, I wanted to like Toad. Though most people think they are. Uh-huh. How's it going? Toad's hiding something, but I don't know what yet. Did say anything? No, nothing really. He was really upset though earlier. He won't say why. Hmm. Something's going on. Stay with the kid until I figure out why. Okay. Uh, I guess I've got all the. Oh. Hang on a second. I thought this was to leave. Why is the lock busted? Eh? The lock. It looks like somebody kicked in the door. A spot of dust and a broken lock. What are you getting at, mate? Oh, for Christ's sake, a fucking lock's been busted for weeks, mate. Right, it's just like everything else in this bloody building. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Why'd you climb in through the window, then? Huh? Why'd you climb in through the window? You said it yourself. <laughs> I've caught him in what, three lies now? You wouldn't have needed a key to get in. Fucking hell. Just what are you on about, mate? After the state I was in, I didn't have me head. That's all it was. I forgot the fucking handle was fucking busted. Uh -huh. And I'll tell you what else. It's embarrassing you bringing all this shit up, all right? So quit it with a third degree and all that. Bigby, come on. I'm begging for mercy over here, old boy. I was looking forward to a nice afternoon, just me and me son, and you've taken up enough of a day with all this, this sniffing around at me private belongings. I'm sorry I called, really I am, but will you please, please just bugger off? Not yet. Not yet, you say, to my face, that you think I'm hiding something from you? Well, you've had to go out of the room for a fair bit of time now. Nothing's here. So when? When are you gonna leave? I mean, I feel like I'm on trial here. In my own bloody home. When? When you start telling me the truth. What's up, Kevin? Well, I've told you the truth, mate. Jesus Christ, what this more do you want? This lying to me. Toad, these stories have made no sense. You didn't cut yourself on the poker. You didn't forget your keys. You didn't bump the lamp off the table. You want to tell me what's going on? She doesn't think much of me, I don't think. Oh, I wouldn't necessarily say that. Progress? Mr. Toad, you're bleeding. Take off the hat. Oh. <sighs> it was that butcher, a, a tweedle. Thumb or D. You gotta strip them down to their johnnies before you can tell which is which. They come bulging in, screaming about something a woodsman had. Or thought he had. I don't know. He tore up the place. Beat me up when I said I didn't have it. I tried to go out the window, but he pulled me back in. <sighs> it's been a hard morning, I could tell you that. What did you tell him? Nothing. 
There's nothing he wanted to know, except if I had this thing that he wanted, I would have told you. I wanted to, really, I did. Uh -huh. But he said if word of this ever got back to him, if he ever thought you knew, well, Miss White, he'd come back and kill my boy. I even tried to give the bastard a coat. He wouldn't take it. Whose coat? The girl. Dad borrows things from people who live here. Uh, sometimes? Borrows? I don't steal nothing. Turn around here would astonish you, mate. We'll merely repossess what's been left behind. Well, we'll be taking the coat now. If she has next of kin, family, anyone. All right. Fetch him the fur. Oh, her Find donkey dress coat. Is. No, I wouldn't wear it. Interesting. Outside. Wait. It's an envelope. Fucking hell, of course there is. If my luck, it's a map to some bloody doubloons. It's addressed to Prince Lawrence. Do you want to try and give it to him, or...? Open that shit up! Open it up! I'm sorry. Faith. What could she have been sorry for? I don't know. Bro, I'm pretty sure Lawrence is dead, Maybe so... Lawrence does. Feels better. Well, it's, it's not been gonna be quite a surprising day for all of us, hasn't it? I'd see you out, but I'm afraid of dripping any more blood in the place. It was very nice talking to you, TJ. Thanks. Uh, see ya. Does he have an anti-lily pad on his shirt? I was worried he was gonna yell at him. Does it always go that smoothly? Not often. So, the prince is now? Lawrence is, yeah. It's our best lead. Our only lead, really. When he put it that way. What happened to the coat? I don't want to stay here any longer than we have to, so let's just pick an approach and stick to it, okay? Just humor me. When the magic mirror showed me this apartment, I think I saw a knife inside, covered in what looked like blood. I wasn't expecting that. Yeah. Well, like I said, let's not overcomplicate things. You can question him while I look around for it. And if he objects? We're here on official Fable Town business. She trusts and me we can more? Be persuasive I what, told her the truth. <laughs> or you can. I just look, I don't talk in. Can you hear me? <laughs> Can you hear me? <laughs> Body on the floor. <sighs> it's open. Don't just peep into someone's house. Check if he's home. Literally blood all over the place, lady. Hello? Can you hear me? Times two to the corpse on the ground. dead for a while. Why did he just scowl at her? Also in the mirror he wasn't slumped over. Or he wasn't on the floor. Oh my god. Hey, hey, stay with me, Lawrence. Gonna no. be alright. No. What 
is it that you're telling us? Bigby, water. Kitchen. Bro, he's dying. I think there's like a literal hole in that man's head. Did you find it yet? There's some medicine on top of the fridge. Can you saunter faster? Something to ask him. You should do it now. What happened? <laughs> Faith. <sighs> oh. Not really an answer. But I don't know that he killed her. Mainly because he's in this state. <laughs> Do you still have that letter? Yeah, see, I told you he was dead and he wouldn't need the letter. I'm still a good detective. <laughs> it's only two words, but he died without seeing them. I'm sorry. That's evidence, we lady. Need to figure out what happened here and find whoever did this. Okay. Okay. Digging those shoes, bro. Princess style. What are they? Prescription sleeping pills. That doesn't really help. Why did he turn it off? going all crazy because the TV's on. That's the lighting in front of the TV. Will you pick it up? Fingerprints? They'll be on the grip and the trigger. And now all over the barrel because you touched it. Can I pew pew people? Sharp. There's blood on the blade. Is that the same knife you saw in the mirror? Yeah. I don't know why it's over here. I just don't understand. Why would someone want to kill him? Did someone kill him or did he kill himself? The gun is still there. He's just been here. When do you think that was taken? Before all this. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Bullet. Bullet passed through the chair. Yeah. The angle works if he shot himself. That's what I was thinking. <laughs> that slide in. Oh, woof. I don't think that's how that works, but okay. Look, the thing. Click, click, click. 
strange. Hard edge to this pool, like something was here and got moved. That looks like a door and it's a bed. It pulls down. Pull on it. Son of a Crudy! I don't have my water! You know what? Hang on. I'm gonna go get it. Thanks for the water, Crudy. Whew. Though you're right, I should have water with me always. But you know how I am about coffee. <laughs> I have my coffee. <laughs> okay. Alright. Thanks for the water, Crudy. It is a good idea, though. What is that? Dear Spade, I never meant to hurt you. Can I see overtime? <laughs> and I cannot endure knowing that I have. This was for the best. I'll see you again. Love, you're devoted. Stop it! Oh, okay. Never meant to hurt you. So he shot himself. And she never came back. Uh, so I think he he was thinking she was going to come back. Her note on the fridge is that she's leaving him, pretty much. This is his suicide note. That stuck to the bed a little. Ew. My dearest Faith, I never meant to hurt you, and I cannot endure knowing that I have. This was for the best, and I'll see you again. Love, your devoted Lawrence. Hopefully they're together now. Not all we can hope for at this point. That's sad though. He saved her from her weird ass abusive father. They were living out eternity together. They seemed happy. What turned her into a prostitute? Second if that was even bags. what she was doing. Old encyclopedias. Dusty. No one's read these in a while. Like, if those other people showed up to that wood guy's place, maybe she knew that there was something there. And maybe. Oh my god! Stay here! <sighs> no! There was a large man in that closet! Hey! Stop! <laughs> Leave me alone! Oh, go, 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 go. Poor guy. Yeah, I chose the correct door. This is 
one of the Tweedle Ease up, Bigby. Boys. We're on the same side here. You son of a bitch. Make me run after you. Who are you? Who are you? What? Who are you? Listen, man. I'm a private investigator. A man's dead. I know how it looks, but I had nothing to do with that. Bullshit. You're covered in blood. Look, I was just asking him about the girl. That's all. When I mentioned her being dead, he freaked out. I figured someone had told him. How was I supposed to know? Shit. Fucker shot himself right in front of me. I couldn't stop him, man. No, he didn't. You're looking for the woodsman, right? I know he where said he the is. Gun hadn't been fired the guy in says he's holed up while. at the trip trap. We can go over there right now, the both of us. My employer's looking to ask him a few questions too. Hit him! Arr! The fuck? Come on, dumb. Dumb? Yeah, it is. Look, it'd be much easier for you. No, to... I'm D. He's dumb. Oops. Oh no, did I die? You almost looked peaceful. Oh. They left me. Yep. Except you're lying in a dirty alley. Yep. With an open wound on the back of your head. Yep. Where'd they go? Well, after the one guy hit you and the other one finished kicking you. That explains the ribs. Then they jumped into a car and drove off. Come on, get up. Guess we're out of options. She looks mad. He mentioned the trip trap. Then that's where we'll go. I'll call a cab. There wasn't like a way for me to call him out on his lie, though. Other than him. Every time I think I'm getting a handle on what's going on, weird transitions. things just get more complicated. It feels like we're always a step behind. The woodsman is the only lead we've got. And I'm he glad was one of the last too. people to I'm see Faith alive. One. Getting some answers out of him will start to clear things like, up. Like, how did that guy know that she I was dead? Right. Bigby? To tell him. Be honest with me. Who do you think did this? I know it's still early, but I just feel a step behind. It's an uncomfortable it's feeling. Bluebeard. What the fuck is Bluebeard? I can't tell if you don't know or just won't say. I don't know! My silence left me unsure. I am unsure! <laughs> Thanks I wish you. there was... Sorry. Go ahead. I didn't mean to cut you off. No, it's... It's nothing. I just... I think she's cute. <laughs> Seeing all this today, there are fables that are struggling worse than I'd imagined. We pay so much attention to the residents of the woodlands. You forget there's a whole community out there to serve. To have to turn to... prostitution. I... I wish there was more we could do. This isn't how I thought it would be. But Crane runs things his own way. Crane is the one to blame here, not you. Obviously you don't know what I do all day. Right now... I'm the gatekeeper, making sure none of these disenfranchised folks are, as he puts it, wasting his time. I'm more to blame than anyone. You'll fix it. Oh no, game. Are you gonna pull some know. weird shit and make her the it's bad just guy? The, broken system. the fables who walk in through the back door like Bluebeard, we have all the time in the world for them. You try and come in through the front door through the proper channels asking for 
anything needing help. Well, I turn you away. Who is Bluebeard? Now things are worse off than they've ever been. Well, that's not true. Right. We've had it worse, but not by much. Maybe this isn't for me. I thought public service was pure. You should stick it out. There are fables that would give up a lot to be in the position you're in, and I think it's easier to change something from the inside. Okay, there we go. The They're second part. The change comes from within. Uh, yeah, if you leave, sure. she's like an Not asset. The advice I imagined hearing from you. Feeling this way, I'm she can change things. Full of surprises. Things. If she leaves, she can't change. Jump. Okay, hold on. We're gonna pause it there. Ad's gonna start. This is a good segue into whatever's about to start. So I'll be right back.
Ah. Okay. I gotta get back in the groove of streaming. I keep trying to hit my... Like, I've got my shortcuts set up on my Tartarus. Tartarus? Is it Tartarus? It's, it's this... Hold on, maybe I can lift it up. Can you see this in stream? This thing. The Tartarus. Yeah. See, okay, so... Hold on. The Tartarus, I'm pretty sure, is from Persona 3. I'm pretty sure that's where you go to fight the bad guys. <laughs> so that's why my brain's like, no, that's wrong. Anyway, I have this set up to, like, change my, like, my scenes. Like, I'll lie. I'm not ending stream. I just flashed that. So, but you could get, like, what I'm talking about. So, anyway. Uh, and I keep trying to do that on my number pad for some reason. And that's not, I've never had it set to my number pad. I don't know what's wrong. Anyway. Yeah, maybe you should handle this one. That guy looks like a pimp. Yeah. Straight up. Yeah, should. Yep, she's not gonna... Uh, <laughs> she's too soft for this. Aww. Big B. Three apples. The new Broadway hit. I... Um, just be careful. Please. Aw, she likes you, bro. Always. She's leaving. I have no car. <laughs> the trip trap bar. Trip trap. It's a trap. I. This is. <laughs> That lady did not look what do you happy want, to see Sheriff? me. I was in the neighborhood. Thought I'd pop in and say hello. Well, fucking hello. <laughs> now you can get the fuck out of here. <laughs> look, I'm not even gonna ask where he is now, okay? I just want to know the last time he was here. That's all. Who? Who? I'm being nice. So try again. He hasn't been here for a few weeks. No, maybe. I don't know. But yeah, he hasn't been here in a while, if he's been here at all, which... Uh, I don't know. Does he tell you when to close, too? Nope. And he doesn't tell me when to tell you to fuck off. I like her. I never turned to drink. Wait, I never turned to drink. It seemed to turn to me. Benjamin Franklin. Mm. He a regular? I don't know who you're talking about. The one with the bald head and the beard. Never seen him. Lady, like... Whose is that? Someone who left. Why didn't you dump it? If you want a cleaner place, feel free to get the fuck out of here. I'm sensing a very hostile tone from you. Don't deny it, but I'm good at picking up on this stuff. Can I have a pickled egg? Let me solve the mystery for you. They're pickled eggs. Oh, I know what they are. I'm just trying to figure out why anyone would eat this. Uh, cause they're awesome! Are you serious right now? <laughs> this man is dissing pickled eggs. <laughs> We're gonna have problems. 
yo, pickle dicks are so good, and they definitely hit so different when you're drunk. I don't know that I've ever had a pickled egg at a bar, though, now that I think about it. Damn. Huh, you have no money for your cigarettes, sir. You gave it to the prostitute that died. You guys playing right now? Nah. She's not gonna answer any of your questions. I don't know why you keep asking this lady. Any damn thing. If you're not playing, <laughs> you don't mind if I, uh... <laughs> Get bent. <laughs> I love it. I love his energy. Uh, this man's last name is Wolf, which I think is awesome. It makes me love him even more. It's just not, it doesn't have an E on the end of it. <laughs> 24 hours in a day, 24 beers in a case. Oh, I've seen this. It's stupid. Dry gin. Drink, eat, bite. Rockfest. Stool. You gonna sit next to him? Yep. Okay. A lot of stools in this place. But there's only one right next to you. You gonna order something? Or are you just here to bother my customers? You know what I mean. <laughs> me I didn't get it at first. <coughs> you want a lime? Sure. I think they have some at the bar down the street. <laughs> oh my god. Think that's funny? Yep. Think it's fucking hilarious. It was alright. <laughs> that's alright. Come on, guys. I don't want to be here. You don't want me here. The sooner you answer my questions, the sooner I'll be out of your... Oh, okay. It's like somebody's about to hit me. Digging that dude's eyeballs. Holly, you're out of paper towels and the... It's the woodsman. Bro got his ass kicked last time. Saved your beer for you. Holly wanted to clear it, but uh, I said no. You'll be back. Now, here you are. <laughs> you and me have been going at it for hundreds of years. I'm through fighting. Well, Woody, that makes two of us. So he is the big bad wolf in the thing. Or all he's and all look, the wolf. I decided to switch seats. Just want to talk. This doesn't have to go like this. Maybe he don't want to talk to you. Why don't we let him tell me that? Am I supposed to be? Because his eyeballs okay, weird. Man. It's funny. Just a minute ago, no one seemed to know who you were. Yeah, well, everyone knows you. Big bad wolf. <laughs> no, I'm the bad guy and you're a sheriff. What kind of fucking world is that, huh? Not exactly comfortable with it either, but... Hey, you play the hand you're dealt. Well, some folks are forced to play with shit. That's a lovely image. Guess you want to know about the girl. Amongst other things, sure. 
I'd walked past her place for weeks. She didn't look like it, but she had money. I was sure of it. And she wouldn't put up any kind of fight. <laughs> I was gonna rob her. And the night I finally get up the nerve to do it, there you are, fucking things up for me. You were just in the wrong place at the wrong time. What are you talking about exactly? Red Riding Hood, her grandmother. I was there to rob him. Oh. But when I showed up, you were already there, lying in the bed. I only saved her because I thought she might give me a reward. But she didn't give me shit, except a bunch of people thinking I'm something I ain't. I played along as long as I could. Only thing I managed to get from it was a free drink every now and again. <laughs> Not a good Let that did. Hey, stop! This isn't what I want! Oh, shut the fuck up, Woody! Shit ain't just about you. It's about this fucking lapdog. Only come sniffing around this part of town when the rich fucks in the woodlands need a shakedown. Ain't that right, Big B? It's not like that. There are problems with the way things go, I get it. But that's got nothing to do with what's happening right now. Holly's sister goes missing. No one gives two shits about her. Paperwork, waiting rooms, and that bitch Snow White looking right past me, then ushering me out the fucking door. Anyone tell you you've got a big fucking mouth? I should've hit him. Oh, it gets bigger. Oh, good. Ooh. Should have walked out of here. What is that? Why? Come on, you're scaring the lady. Don't worry about me. Hello, lady. Okay, hang on a second. <laughs> oh, never mind. <laughs> So it's like giving me the This thing is creepy. What's it supposed to be? <laughs> it's the cigarette taste box. This guy, I love the humor. It's pretty, pretty good. Oh, shoot. Oh, this is the comic. I mean, I have to find this comic. I don't remember this. Tear up his arm. We're not gonna tear up his arm. There's a lady present. <laughs> oh, that was awesome. Whiskey. Give him the bottle, lady. Okay. <laughs> Save 
here tomorrow. Shit. It's not like you were gonna pay for it anyway. I tried, I tried. Don't even think about it. Is this the type of treatment I can expect if I let you take me in? Hey, he started it. <laughs> All right, I got a hundred bucks for the first bloke that can tell me something about a girl name. <laughs> he shows up, and there's a fable crying. <laughs> Choose again. Fuck, man. That's not necessary. Shit. He's the one you want, not me. Your brother won't be saving you this time. Come on. You're under arrest. I told you I didn't do it. And you got nothing to worry about. <laughs> I may have made the wrong choice. <laughs> but this guy did beat me up and leave me in an alley. <laughs> Do anything stupid and I'll throw you down the witching well myself. What kind of, what was that? Finally found some normies. Oh no, it's gonna be the other woman. Or the head. I guess that would make somebody sick too. I swear to God, if it's snow, I'm gonna freak out. That's what it's like building up to be. It was! Oh my God, did I do that? Was there some choice that I could have made to save her? I'm upset. Next time. We had something here. very special. Where's your brother? Fuck you! Give me one good reason I should tell you anything. Serial killer. Oh, oh my. A serial killer? Oh god, and it's one of us. Wait, the woodsman's still walking the streets. We've got to put a lid on this. If you can't manage it, I'll find someone who can. I found out where she's been staying. I know she's here. Hold you up! Seen her. I just saw some boobies. Hide. Is that okay? <laughs> Twitch is gonna get mad at me. Maybe you just wanna play. Lady, someone. put on a shirt. <laughs> what did you do? Friend on friend. At the end of the end. Jesus Christ, baby. Is that you? Player choices. What does this mean? Did you give Faith your money? You and oh, cool. You and eighty-four point five percent of players gave Faith your money. 
Okay, did you tell Beast the truth about beauty? You and 59% of players lied and said you hadn't seen beauty. Where did you decide to go first? You and 69.2% of players went to help Toad before Prince Lawrence. What happened to Prince Lawrence? You did not prevent Prince Lawrence's death. So that is preventable. Hold on. Oh, who is your prime suspect? You and 26.8% of players didn't say anything to Snow. Who's this? It's the Bluebeard guy that we haven't seen and know nothing of, but they keep throwing out there. I think it's supposed to be, like, if you keep saying it's Bluebeard, it's because he's, like, crazy, like, obsessed with Bluebeard. Because in the beginning, he's got all those documents with, or, like, the folders of people that he's investigating, and one of them was Bluebeard. Or, or Bla it wasn't Blackbeard. I think I'm pretty sure it was Bluebeard. What's up, Zenrai? Yo! Is it Zen? Is it Zenari? No, Zenrai. I always like mess up pronouncing it, I think. Oh, four four percent said her dead husband. Twenty two percent said this person. Who's this person? Oh, maybe this is Bluebeard. Who did you arrest? When it came down to the wire, you and 68.7% of players made sure Twiddle D didn't get away. How's life and the mindset? That's pretty good. I can't complain. I'm having a good time. We've got things happening. Which, by the way, I don't know if I said anything because I didn't do news today. Uh, I have an interview on Friday. That's all I'm going to say about it. So, wish me luck. Good vibes. I need it. And it's before a stream, so after stream or after my interview, I'll be able to stream. <clears throat> so, hold on. Now what? Do I have access to the other chapters? Previous menu. Is that it? Thank you! Thank you for the luck! I do need it! I haven't had an interview in like two years! I'm kind of nervous. <laughs> Wait, extras. Oops. Yeah, okay. I do have the rest. Oh, that's perfect. I wonder if the timing is going to be that way for each episode. Because it's right here at 5 o'clock, which is when I need to leave. And maybe I can do an extra one on Friday. I don't want to see the achievements. <clears throat> Grendel. Grendel just wants to be left alone. In the old days, he terrorized Norse mead halls, but lately he can be found occupying a stool in various quiet, dumpy bars around New York. He hates the noise of the city, but must work there to afford his glamour. Despite his gruff bearing, hold on. Yeah, okay. Just do it. despite his gruff bearing, he's fiercely loyal to those who've learned to offer him the space and silence he desires. Talking to him is like watching a time bomb tick. Oh, time bomb tick down. It's only a matter of time. He was awesome. Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna snooze ad because I'm leaving. I'm not, I don't want to play ad right now. Okay. Holly. Oh, she's a troll! I like her horns. I love this. <clears throat> Holly is a no-nonsense kind of troll and the owner of the Trip Trap Bar. Okay, that's cute. 
She's glamoured to appear human, but her patrons know better. Holly takes good care of her regulars, often the downtrodden fables with little to spare, but she has no patience for the fable town government that has done nothing to locate her missing sister. Who's her missing sister? That is Bluebeard. <coughs> oh, thank you. Much love. I'm not the type of person to ever just give up, so I'll beat my face on it until I get something. And then recently, I've been doing a lot of the landscape studies. And I know everybody's been seeing that on my Instagram. But I'm feeling pretty good with that. Like, I, I enjoy it more than anything else. But I'm starting to get the whole layering process for, like, background and stuff. And I already, like, in class and even after class, I really liked parallax animation. And that's usually background stuff. And more recently, even in this game, I've been noticing how much parallax is going on. Because you, you can see the animations behind this menu... They're just stacked on top of each other, going at different speeds. And that's pretty cool. But like earlier, well not earlier, last week when we were playing Cult of the Lamb, that has so much parallax background information going on all at once, and it looks so cool. So like there's like a need for it, so I want to try to master it. I don't know, I started, the, I heard a jack of all trades as master of none, which makes sense. But I no longer want to just try to learn everything. I want to I want to master something. So that way I can be like, look at this thing that I did. Doing it for myself. Maybe. <laughs> <clears throat> so I love that there's all of this ex these extra fables that aren't just the ones that were on that main tapestry. I'm excited to see. No, not the farm. I'm excited to see the Headless Horseman. I did want to read this guy's thing. <clears throat> Bluebeard managed to escape the homelands with his riches intact and continues to be one of the wealthiest fables in New York. The Fable Town government depends on his generous con contributions and he often uses his influence for his own benefit. As a former serial killer... As a former serial killer, he claims his days of decapitating his brides are over. But even if he was able to leave his violent ways in the homelands, that hasn't stopped him from making the occasional trip down Crooked Lane. <laughs> He's known for decapitating women. <clears throat> And we have two decapitated lady heads. <laughs> Interesting. Where's the other guy? Are they gonna show us him? Oh, look, it's Toad. Slumlord? Oh, that's so sad. One, two. Oh, are these the chapters? Did I miss somebody? Oh. Oh, that makes sense. Hydrate. Okay. <clears throat> Thanks for the water. Oh, they just used... Okay, I was like, why is there a portrait? I don't see the other guy. Maybe that's what this was. Okay, it's trying to run out again, so I'm going to go ahead and go. I will be here. What is tomorrow? Tomorrow's Thursday, right? I'm, I'm going to shoot for one tomorrow, just so we can try to get through maybe two chapters. Because if, if there's five of them, it would take us five days, as it seems. So I'd like to do as much as possible. <clears throat> Although I don't really know what we're going to play after this. I've really enjoyed this. This is really cool. So also this was um, a gift from a friend. Uh, I don't know if they'd want me to say who they are. But thank you. Super shout out. Uh, is 